Welcome to WISIS Forum 2022 here in Geneva and with me is Her Excellency Justina Olofska, um, the Prime Minister's High Representative for GovTech. And your field of expertise is digital transformation in education. Tell us all about that. Yeah, digital transformation in education is a crucial thing nowadays around the world in any place. Because, okay, we are talking uh, the, here at, at WISIS Forum 2022 about uh, how is this important to have connectivity um, between countries, between and between our cities, even uh, with within our cities at schools too. And for example, so far we have uh, managed to have covered all Poland, all Polish schools in fast internet, and this connectivity really do, is driven uh, very digitally uh, schools into the upper level. But of course. Uh, to do that, we need talent. And talent is a key and it is, uh, of course, okay, you can uh, use short-term uh, tools and uh, long-term ones. Of course, uh, from the perspective of the needs that are very huge and even bigger after a pandemic of coronavirus, uh, but you, we need also always think about those long-terms. So investing in K-12 education. Uh, what we have done, we have invested, uh, except uh, of course this uh, connection uh, with uh, whole the Poland with schools with the fast internet. After that, we have invested in such high technologies as 3D printers, microcontrollers, uh, video studios, music studios, Google VRs in every, literally every school in Poland. Why? Because we believe that teaching from the very beginning and attracting young people to such uh, sectors like STEAM, so if with this A letter, with which, which means arts, it's very important because what we are seeing, we are seeing that economy of leisure is growing very fast. So creativity sectors are really also making much, uh, they're more and more important nowadays because people will have more time. So we need to um, make sure that they spend this time effectively. And how is your work addressing the sustainability development goals around equality of access? Because of course we know that, that yeah. girls, women are less likely to go into these jobs and of course they're equally capable. Yeah, that's right, that's right. That is why it is so important to start from the very beginning. Because once you are look at the researchers, it turns out that during primary school, equally girls and boys are very good at math and all those tech uh, tech subjects, tech courses, uh, but it is their decision during going to secondary school. Less girls are choosing uh, tech uh, areas, tech um, tech uh, uh, tech courses during high schools. So it is so important to start from the very beginning, from the first grade. That is why, of course, there are uh, this uh, uh, we call it future labs program with those three D printers, which is uh, you know it uh, more in twenty thousand schools such tools uh, in Poland. But at the same time, we are starting teaching coding from the first grade. Uh, it is all in order to make sure that equally girls and boys are uh, can choose uh, very uh, very uh, conscious what they that they, that is possible to be in tech sector later on. It sounds absolutely brilliant project. I wish you the best of luck with it, uh, Your Excellency. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you very much.